welcome back to my channel and if you are new here welcome and thank you so much for clicking on this video hopefully you consider subscribing to the frugal j family hit the notification bell so you can notify every time this girl brings you a new video and don't forget to please in the beginning in the middle or at the end on your way out to give me a thumbs up it really helps out my channel i'm bringing you a short and sweet dollar tree haul i just wanted to share with you what i found today actually i have a few dollar tree hauls to share with you guys but I'm just going by it. I don't even remember what's in the bags. But we're just going to dive in, okay? I'm going to get the boring stuff out of the way. Because I love me some Mega My Size sheets. Because you get more for your dollar. Dollar Tree, the most they usually carry is the 140 sheets. I used to pick these up all the time. I know you're tired of hearing me saying. Because they had 210 sheets and they went down to 168. But it's still more than the average Dollar Tree sheet. So I pick them up anyways because they do the job and I get more for my dollar. Okay. Okay. And then since I'm going to put my little skinny six foot whatever Christmas tree upstairs on the second floor. So Mr. Noah and I can decorate. And if you don't know who Mr. Noah is, he's my five year old little grandson, my bestie, my best friend. He's my everything. Okay. So I grabbed this to be like my little tree skirt. We're going to lay this on the floor and we're going to decorate for Halloween. And it says, tis the season to be spooky. Because Noah is into Halloween this year. I don't know what it is, but he wants to decorate. So Nana is going to please his, not his, her boy, her grandson, okay? Um, so we pick this up and I'm just going to lay it on the floor and put my little tree on top of it. So it just has a little, like almost like a little tree skirt, but it's not, you know, and then you can still see that it's part of Halloween. All right, so we're going to just dive in. Let me try to get the junk out of the way. I got some Doritos because Noah, if he doesn't want cheese puffs or whatever, he likes Doritos. So ask me if I have Doritos. So I grab a Dorito just in case because I don't know what mood Noah is today. Whatever mood he might be in then. Oh, and I grab some Cheetos. Again, we don't know what mood Mr. Noah is in. So I'm just the kind of grandma that likes to have backup. The backup plan to cover whatever nobody wants to stress about chips nobody and for the boys i grabbed hot chips for the teenage boys in the house and this was new to my dollar tree honey they don't come to our dollar tree like they do in every other state they don't so i'm like what i was shocked to see this there i was like i hope it's not a return <laughs> but they don't take back food and medicine out here so this is gluten-free uts red hot potato chips and it says a dollar ninety nine there, and again we don't get these chips here in Florida, so I was shocked. Well, maybe not in my area at least. I live in Kissimmee, very close to Orlando, and um, yeah, we don't get these at all. I'm trying to see if they have an expiration date because I would hate to grab November 15, twenty twenty one. Enough time, my husband will devour these by tonight probably. So that is it for that bag. And I wanted to do this quick haul only because I found these today. They were new to me. I don't know if you guys ever seen them before, but these are the Snaps Appetizer Loaded Potatoes um, Sticks. I'm thinking that my son might enjoy these. These are the real baked potatoes, cheddar cheese, sour cream, and flavor with bacon and crispy golden coating. And that sounds yummy to me. And they look like that. And you get, um, how many do you get? I thought I saw that somewhere here, honey, but I don't seem to see it now. And then serving size, it says one package. So yeah, and 38 grams of carbs. I'm not eating them, so. Anyways, guys, looks like that. And I grabbed four because I'm thinking that my son's gonna enjoy them. So I just wanna put them away, put them back in the freezer because I think they've been out a little long. All right. I found socks like I need socks but they were too pretty to be left behind they were and if I remember I'll put a picture of the rest of the socks here here or in front of me somewhere might be here so look at these beautiful colors they are coming out already with the snuggadoo socks it says adults feel the softness they are super super soft and I'm in love with the colors like this is me this is me okay I was like, oh my God, yes. And then I grabbed this one. I don't think this one's going to fit me. So it says 
one size but no no and bute that's a lie <laughs> um they were really pretty again i love the color and look at the cute little heart that he has oh my goodness he is so cute and i think i'm gonna probably send these to my granddaughter my granddaughter's gonna be like nana i'm so tired of you sending me socks girl then i grab her these because she loves blue greens and purples and look at this little bad boy like she can just wear him for christmas look how cute and she loves koalas this is, this is a koala right honey um yeah so i got her that and then i got this for a happy mail i don't know if this is the one but i picked it up so this is what the jack-o-lantern i always say that wrong but yeah so i grabbed that I grabbed this spooky little ugly candle. I don't know what I'm going to do with this because if it scares, no, I'm not putting this up. But I don't know. It was just like, what? They have these because let me tell you, the um, Target Bullseye has these for $3. And they're smaller and they're just purple. And the one is purple, one is black, and they're smaller and they're three bucks. Three bucks. The same thing. Um, I grabbed myself the last J I saw because I already have one, but sometimes let's say next year I want to put them in my husband and my nightstand. My husband and I both have the letter J in our name, so I think having them like on our nightstand, I would need two. Or if I want to put them in my hutch, where like something that has to do with me and my hobby or anything, that I just grabbed it. It was the last one. Um, I also grabbed um i grabbed the card and i don't want to read it here but i'm going to show you a little bit i grabbed the card for a special someone in my life and i grabbed this for my car and i forgot to put it in there it's the black ice i picked up a lot of the, those things from dollar tree i forgot the brand but they last a day or two even though this one's not gonna last me any longer but i picked it up and then I have a special event that I will be talking about it more towards um, the day. I, my husband and I have been talking about it and we just like to give back and be helpful and do nice things for others. And so I'm going to be talking more about that, but I'm putting things together. And so when the time comes, I will let you guys know, but I picked up the set of the pink um, pen for breast cancer awareness because I'm gonna need that. I grabbed two of these. I grabbed two more of these because I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna give them to a little girl that I think she will really enjoy this. So I grabbed two more. I got the You Are a Rainbow of Possibilities and Dreamer, Good Things Are Coming, a Yes You Can, Superstar, Spread Kindness. I had to get it. And it comes with the little pink lock and the little pen like what why wouldn't i what else do i have here i was gonna say honey but i know a lot of people get tired of me saying honey so i just can't help myself and then this is new the lip well new to me but i seen like the the pink one it's like a little lip hint color whatever then the cocoa butter and then the original and now they got oh and they got the aloe vera and i almost picked that one by accident thinking it was this one and this one's the lip therapy mint by vaseline what let me see if it's minty because if it's minty girl it's going in my bag it's going in my bag so whenever i'm about to come home honey i can spread some of this Hmm. and i can kiss the hubby Give them some mint, minty kisses. Mmm, that is nice. That is nice. I really like that. It's not like a powerful mint, but it has that nice little mint. And it's really, it just glides. It's really nice. I pick these up every time I see them. The Cheetos, mac and cheese, bold and cheesy. For the boys in the house, for Mr. Noah, for the teenage boys. I grabbed four of these, even though these are cheaper at a Walmart. But guess what? You already know what I'm going to say. Nobody wants to go to Walmart, so I picked up four. And I made, um, I made steak, like with onions and garlic sauteed steak or whatever, and like garlicky potatoes in the oven with like butter and olive oil and all that jazz for dinner. 
Now, I forgot I was going to put these. This is the reason why I picked this up because I really enjoy these. Lindsay, 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 I don't know. Pimientos, slice, sliced peppers or whatever. So I grabbed this and this is not by Greenbrier. So, and you get seven ounces. And I just love to cook with these things. So when I see them, I pick them up. They're just really nice. So I forgot to put on my steak, but my steak was still delicious. And then, oh my God, guys, the obsession with the cocktails. I only allow myself to have like one a day because you all know I'm doing low carb. I have officially dropped like close to 16 pounds. I don't know if you can tell, but I have. And my pants are feeling me loose and baggy and big and I love it. So if I really want something sweet, I'll allow myself to have one a day. So the cocktails, the caramel apple, it is bomb.com. And you only get like 12 pieces, but this is just great for when you just want something a little sweet and not indulge, you know, because in my last bag, my last bag, I got to stop that. My last bag, I found one of these things here. I know my bestie wanted one. I don't know how many bestie wanted. I was trying to find her more. I should have touched her. But I found one more, and I'm going to put this in her um, goodie box that I'm sending her. I grabbed the last one for Happy Mail, and it's a little crooked. Maybe the person that I'm going to send it to can fix it. But, I mean, you if, you, if you're not staring at it, you can't tell. But it was the last one, so I just wanted to please her. I don't know, guys. I grabbed this cute, cute pink scarf for my hair for mm, honey for the holidays for Halloween so I can just wrap it on my hair and make this like super cute and just wrap it wrap that thing so I love that I got that I got this to put in my room because you know we live in Florida and Charlie goes out and he runs everywhere and he just comes in and it's like, dude, you smell like sweat. <laughs> I don't know if dogs sweat, but I'm like, dude, uh-uh. So I'm going to put this in my room because I do not like my house to smell like pet or none of that. Mm -mm, no. It says clean citrus pet. Two times the odor neutralizer. But it is pet. So I'm assuming this is good to like, you know... Get rid of that whatever pet kind of smell tough on pet odors so yeah i'm not a big citrus fan at eh, citrus fan yes i'm not a big fan of citrus smells but i picked it up if it's not going to smell like charlie i'll deal with the citrus and then i picked up three more of these because one of these is going to my bestie for her doggy for the holidays even for valentine how cute would that be I grabbed these two that look more girly, but I was thinking like if I had, like for Easter, what, even though these are not Easter colors. Okay, let's say Valentine's or whatever. I decide to make gnomes because I made them last year for Christmas or Valentine, Valentine. Or if I buy like very plain Jane gnomies, I can update them. Like the little girl can have her ball on her hair. The little boy can have the blue bow on his neck. You don't have to necessarily use these for pets. You can even put a little clip and just add it to a little girl's hair or right here. Like you can do so much with it. And I grabbed this one because it has the leopard cheetah look, whatever, guys. I don't know my spots. I tell you that all the time. And then this one I think will still look cute on Mr. Charlie because he's black and white. And then for Valentine's, he can maybe hold a little heart or something. And look how cute. Oh my God. And what else do I have in this bag? I grabbed Mr. Charlie some Nature's Choice Sweet Potato Duck Strip Recipe. So I got that for him. He likes, he's, he's a little weird. Sometimes he eats them, sometimes he doesn't care for them. And then I grabbed one of the pillow covers in black for my upstairs sectional because it is gray. And I was thinking, guys, I was thinking that I the same thing that people are doing with the t-shirts, because this is a dollar. If I ruin it, I don't care. I'll throw it out. The same thing that people are doing with, um, I have to sit straight because I have a problem with slouching and my back be killing me. Um, people are doing like the little silhouette thing where they put water and Clorox and it just leaves behind, like, you know, that, that 
that um, tie-dye look and then it has the little things for Halloween, whatever I was thinking, I can put it on this pillow cover, spray the Clorox on water and just let it sit there on the sun. And then when I remove it, it looks like a Halloween pillow cover. Like what? So if it works, I'm gonna go get like three more because my sectional has four pillows. So yeah, I'm gonna try that. That's the reason why I bought this thing. It's not like my cup of tea, but this is a nice fabric, especially for Halloween. I think this goes really nice for a Halloween look. So I grabbed that. And then my last item, guys, I told you it was short and sweet. Um, it's the, I grabbed, I found one more pair of the Nomi socks. So on one of my giveaways, I'm just gonna throw this as a surprise on one of my giveaways. So when I do that giveaway, I'll probably announce it or I'll probably just ask, like, how do you feel about Nomi's? And then if your answer to me is like, oh my God, yeah, she really needs these socks or he or whatever. I'm going to put them in there. We'll figure it out, but I'm going to do something with it. So that is my last item, guys. Oh, I was like, oh, wait, I have a bag. Because that's what happens all the time. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Again, it was short and sweet, but I just wanted to share my finds with you guys. I hope you had you guys had a great day. Don't forget to be kind to one another. You don't know what the other person might be going through. I love you all so, so much. And I'll catch you on my next video. Bye.